What's up everybody and welcome to your masterclass in Forest Pack. We start at the absolute beginning and we will cover every single rollout and every single option and tab available to you. We are going to learn how to scatter our objects with custom objects. We will learn how to scatter on splines and surfaces of any shape and size. We'll cover the areas tab, allowing us to scatter on any spline and shape that we want. We're going to learn about gradient maps, maps, include and exclude areas. We're going to go over the painting method, which is a really awesome feature as well to use. We'll then learn how to control our scatters using a color ID map. From there, the distribution mode. Now the distribution mode has different options. We've got the image mode, and under image we'll learn about clusters, collisions, diversity. From there, we're gonna dive into the path mode, which will allow us to scatter on splines. After path is the reference mode, and then after reference mode, we have the particle system. From there, we'll dive into the surface tab and learn all about the UV and XY mode. We're gonna talk about the altitude. We're gonna talk about the slope range and the direction that we actually wanna scatter everything on, making sure we can scatter on any size and shape for our forest pack. The the items editor will allow us to control individual items. We've got the camera mode, which is really important, allowing us to control our system resources. The transform tab, giving us full control over all of our scatters, making sure that they look randomized and natural. Materials tab has the ability for us to change all the materials randomly in our scatters. The effects tab, which has some really awesome features for us to use in our visualizations, will cover some effects that you can use as well, and we'll go over all of the animation options that we have. The Forest Lister has its own tool, making sure we understand what we are seeing and how to use it to make sure that our pipeline is fluid. The Library Browser lesson will teach us how to create our very own libraries from external sources and how to manage and organize everything nice and neatly. We'll go over a couple of the presets and making sure that we understand how each one works. We're then going to learn about the LOD or level of detail. We've got the great feature called Forest Sets. So as you can see, we are going to cover absolutely everything in this masterclass, making sure that you know how to use every single option and tool available to you. At the end of this course, you will have the full technical knowledge of how Forest Pack works from start to finish, which means you can take on any project, small, medium or large.